Hello everyone, it is Brie and welcome back to another Roblox video and today we are back on Overlook Bay and I was thinking, you know what, I would really 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 love to make my dream home in Overlook Bay. So I will be taking my small tiny home that is pastel pink and I will be turning that into basically a gigantic penthouse and I thought it would be a really good idea to do that now because they had a new furniture update. So I'm really excited to basically own my first penthouse in Overlook Bay and completely decorate it. So let's go ahead and purchase it so we can see what it looks like beforehand. Um, so let's go ahead and add new. We want a penthouse apartment. Let's go ahead and buy it. Gotta buy it with Robux, I think. I don't know, but it's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and buy that penthouse. And let's see, it's right here. Penthouse apartment. Ooh, wait, change paint color. I don't think you change the paint color of a whole penthouse apartment. I don't know. But let's go ahead and go to it. Ooh, so excited. Oh my gosh, this is my very own penthouse. It is so huge. I hope I don't struggle building in this. But look at there's an indoor pool. This is super cute. Like you can just relax in here. That's super awesome. And then over here, you have a whole view of the entire city from around the entire penthouse, which is awesome. I love being able to see the city from up above. It just looks so pretty. And I can't wait to see what it looks like at nighttime as well. I think it looks super pretty. Um, okay, so we have like a glass wall there. I'm just trying to see, scan my surroundings, see how I want to build things. What's the layout of things? But it's super cool. We have two rooms here. So let's get into the speed build and I hope you guys enjoy.
All right guys, the penthouse is finally done being built and it took me absolutely forever and by forever I literally mean weeks because I had to do it in sections, it takes a lot of time and it also takes a lot of gems which I did not expect. So um, I guess now it's time to give you guys a small tour if you couldn't really see how everything was because there's a lot of running around in the speed build so I'm gonna give you guys a little tour in real time um, over here so basically actually <laughs> let's start from the beginning here I built a new wall here because I thought it'd be cute to kind of section off because the penthouse is a very big huge building with a lot of airy space so I was like we can kind of make it smaller so we can fit some more rooms which is how we have this little living room now it has like these cute sofas um, we have a some food bowls and water bowls over here as well as a pet bed so that you know if you're on the go and you really need to leave the house and just come in really quick or whatever um, you can do your pet needs right here and you don't have to walk all the way to the other room because again the pet house is huge and it takes some time walking from room to room um, and then over here we have the kitchen with a handmade um, countertop like a center island which I really like it's really cute um, and then of course everything's like a pastel pink and then honestly with this build I was expecting to have it be um, Mainly pastel pink and I think it still is but there's a lot of hint of other colors in there Which I really like because I love all the other colors as well not as much as pink But I love them as much and but yeah, this is the kitchen and I think it's really cute and then the dining room which I have made this table by combining four of the dining room tables i'm not sure if it is a dining room table but by combining four tables and i put a little tv so if you want to watch tv while eating you can do that and there's also like a little bar here and some bar stools which i thought would be really cute let's see how it looks when you sit there it's a little high but i had to do what i could with what i was provided with so but i think it's really cute like when you're, you're not sitting there just for aesthetic wise i think it's really cute um, going back to the beginning over here, we have some tables with some elephants and some decorations and a little like kind of corner sofa hangout area. If you have like guests come over and you want to talk to them and it's like for a short visit, here's the place to do it. And then over here, we have our pool area, which is really cute. I'm actually pretty proud of what I was able to do here. I've seen other people put tables and chairs around it, which I think is actually really cute as well. Um, but I was not thinking about it at the time. Instead, I have a little bar here as well. I guess you can call it like the tiki bar or something like that. Um, and then we have some rainbow lights on the ceiling, which I thought was really cute And then we put a strip of neon lights around the edge of the pool in the inside So it'd be like a little rainbow at nighttime Which if by the time I end this tour or get to the end and it's nighttime, I'll show you guys what that guy that, ugh, I'll show you guys what that looks like um, And then right here we have like our kind of hangout living room area where it's like TV and stuff and then a handmade moon I don't know how I feel about the moon. I think I really like it, but um, I don't know. I think I do like it. It was um, a practice Something to practice with and I think it came out pretty good because I'm not really good with pixel art and all that stuff But I'm pretty proud of it and then over here We have another dining room table as you guys can see it's a lot of tables and chairs and sofas because it is again really hard to fill in like big spaces um, So yeah, we have like a little reading like table like this is relaxation you know play on your tablet here or something like that you know and then right here this is the reading nook i really actually this this is like one of my favorite areas i think it's really cute um really open very airy and it looks like happy like a happy place to me um right and then over here we have kind of like this is some wall stuff you don't typically sit here but you can but it's more of like a wall decoration kind of thing um, and then in here we have the pet room in which I have raised the bathtub here uh, Which I thought was really cute to raise it up. I wanted to make it originally like a circle But I think this was um, a better use for it and then we have our pet food bowl and our pet water bowl um, a handmade counter and another little hangout area if you want to like, you know Hang out with another person who has a pet and you can just kind of watch them play together for like a, a pet play date Stuff like that. That would be really cute. Um, and then the bathroom, which I'm pretty proud of, but also is kind of empty. It is really hard building in a huge home like this. Let me know how that went for you guys, by the way. If you've ever built in the penthouse, let me know how hard it was to fill in space. Um, but yeah, I think this area is really cute as well. Um, I, I think it would be pretty nice to have some curtains, though, because it's like you're pretty exposed. But it's pretty cool. I like how I built this area. And then I decided, I've never seen Harry Potter, but 
um people have told me that harry potter grew underneath the bookcase or something like like not a bookcase but underneath the stairs i don't know maybe i'm thinking of somebody else but i call this the harry potter book corner so you can like read your books here and hang out it's kind of like kind of secretive in a way you wouldn't expect that to be there in a normal house um but yeah and then up here um, we have another little hangout nook where you can like this is very much like a party place There's a lot of places to just sit around and talk um, And then I decided to add some wall decor by using um, I think it's a painting or I'm not sure I think it's a frame and we did it with different color squares and I actually really really like it. it's like abstract art But pastels so I really like that and then we have some neon strip lights that go all the way around here Which I really like looks really pretty at night and then my room which is really I actually really like this room It's really really cute very pastel pink with some hints of some other colors. We got a gaming computer Gaming corner. We got our little hangout corner over here too um, Our clock our TV and the stars on the wall. I really like um, and then over here we have the bathroom which I did kind of last minute because again I was like running out of gems um, But it's got like a pastel yellow theme and it's really cute. There's some butterflies You can see the lighthouse over there um, But it's really cute. I like this one. I didn't I don't think there was too much space in this one So it worked out good and then the guest bedroom Which is like a light blue theme and kind of like purple and like pink So it's like mainly light blue and then some other colors that are pastel as well But yeah, this is the guest bedroom and uh, I think that's it So let me know what you thought about it in the comment section below Let me know if you liked it Let me know what your attempts were like to decorate your own penthouse and let me know what you would like to see me build in the future. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye.